Hey there, everybody. Welcome to the Cat Daddy TV Show, episode number four. I am your host, Mr. Ryan McDonald. Today is a cooking episode, so today is a cooking day. Today, I'm going to show you all how to make chicken nuggets with chips in the Phillips air fryer. Right, you'll need a couple of things. First thing you will need is, of course, the Phillips air fryer. I have an old-fashioned one, and this is what it looks like. You have... The pan, this is where all the food is stored. This is where everything cooks in. And along with that, you have the, of course, the air fryer handle. And this is where you put the food. This is where you hold it. And it fits in like this. You see? That is what it looks like when it's in place. You pull it by the handle. And you'll need a couple of other things. Next thing you'll need is a spatula. Here is my spatula. Got a lot of spatula. Spatulas are really good for spooning food out of cooking pans. That way you protect your fingers from getting burned. Very important. Next thing you'll need is a knife so you can cut the chicken nuggets up. And next thing you'll need is some bowls to put your sauces in. Personally, myself, I love to have malt vinegar and barbecue sauce. But a lot of people in New Zealand have tomato sauce because we're Kiwis. But personally, myself, I like to have American barbecue sauce because I like that tangy taste. So if you like, you can put sauces and dips in here. This type of thing, if you have it. And... What I use is I use super fries, chips, shoestring, and I use crumbed chicken nuggets to cook with. And what I like to do is I like to put a little bit of salt and pepper over it. This is iodized table salt. And this is the recipe for cooking it. Hopefully you can see that. Turn it. There we go. That's what the recipe looks like. And I shall read out the recipe to you guys now. To cook chips in the air fryer, step one is you turn the air fryer on at the wall. First step, make sure the power's on. Step two, turn the air fryer on on the screen. Step three, you insert 200 degrees Celsius and you preheat to 200 degrees Celsius in the temperature. That's very important as the air fryer needs to hot up first. Do be careful because it will get very, very hot. So make sure you protect your hands, wear gloves. And the next thing you do is after you've preheated to 200 degrees, step four is you press that play button. Step five says here the air fryer will make a sound when it's ready to start cooking at this okay then you pull out the tray step six step seven you put your chips and your chicken nuggets in i like to use crumbed chicken nuggets so you put your chips and your crumbed chicken nuggets in step seven step eight as you close the drawer and you do this by using the handle step nine is you insert eight minutes into the time. So it cooks for eight minutes. That's very important. 
Make sure it's eight minutes. That way it cooks properly. So that's step nine. Step 10 is you finally press the play button and it will start cooking for you. That's step 10. Step 11 is when it is finished cooking, you pull out the tray and you empty your chips and your crumb chicken nuggets onto the plate, ready to serve. So that's that, folks. That's how you cook crumbed chicken nuggets and shoestring super fries, chips and chicken nuggets in an air fryer, Phillips air fryer. Hope you enjoyed that, folks. Thanks for watching. You are watching the Cat Daddy TV show, episode number four. I am your host, Mr. Ryan McDonald. Thanks for watching, everybody. See ya. Bye. Yeah.